The introduction and use of motorbikes for commercial purposes, popularly known as Okada in Ghana, has generated a lot of controversy. Apart from the fact that the introduction was capricious, the operators have taken the road traffic laws into their own hands, violating them with careless abandon. Not even the promulgation of a law against the practice will deter the use. What is intriguing is that the commercial motorbike business is an adaptation from the sub-regional neighboring countries including Togo, Benin, Nigeria and Burkina Faso. Yet the operators have completely ignored the best practices in road traffic regulations. On a visit to Benin's capital, I hopped onto an Okada to purposely examine their operations. Here in Kotonou, motorbikes outnumber vehicles on the road and can carry any load along with pullion riders possible. Again, the commercial riders belong to unions. Union members wear identifiable reflective uniforms and bores with their registration numbers. But the most admirable aspect of the Okada operation here is the respect for traffic regulations. Unlike Ghana, where riders jump red light at will, operators in Kotonou stop at traffic interceptions. They acknowledge this reduces road traffic crashes.